Hi guys, the Switch emulator Yuzu has recently gotten a super useful update which enables you to play almost all Nintendo Switch first person shooters with perfect mouse and keyboard controls. So let me show you how to set it up in Metroid Prime Remastered. First of all, you have to open Yuzu and go to the emulation settings, then to configure and then to the controls tab. And now the most important thing is to set the motion, so the gyro controls of your emulated pro controller to mouse. So you do that by clicking on this field and then pressing the left mouse button again so that mouse appears in this box. Now, just set up the rest of the buttons as you please. So, for example, movement on WASD and then control as a modifier to sneak. So, this means that if you hold control while pressing WASD, you only move the virtual control stick halfway. And this way you walk instead of running. And then visor select or weapon select on the D-pad. So for example, one, two, three, four clockwise because that's approximately the order you unlock the visors and weapons in the game. And then the map on plus, so set it on tab or something like that and minus opens the options menu. So set it, for example, on escape or whatever you place. And now shooting is on A. So just set it to the left mouse button and jumping on B. So set it to space. This way you don't need to bind ZR and L, which also only serve as buttons for shooting and jumping but you can't use those buttons to navigate through menus so they are completely superfluous. Then weapon select works by holding down the X button and choosing the respective weapon with the D-pad so set it on something like mouse wheel button or something. And R is used for shooting missiles. So I just put it on my fourth mouse button. You can also set it on F or E or something. And Y is the button which you use to switch to more form mode. So set it to something else that's easily reachable, like C or something, or my fifth mouse button. And now the only other important thing is to make sure you don't have any mouse access, so any mouse controls bound to the red right stick, so just put in some buttons, so for example the arrow keys there, you won't really need them, but you can do it anyway, or just unset them. And once you've done everything, don't forget to save it to a new profile by just pressing U and entering some name. And then just apply it. So just by pressing OK. And now you notice that you still cannot move your direction probably because you haven't enabled gyro controls in the controls menu in game. So for this you have to set the control scheme to dual stick. So leave it at the default value 
but then camera is set by default to stick only and you have to set it to gyro and stick to enable gyro controls and once you've done that you can also set the gyro sensitivity turn it a bit up so in this way the stabilization function of the gyro input won't bother you as much and once you've done it go back to the game and now press ctrl and f9 to bind the mouse cursor to the game and this way you should now be able to move the mouse around by just moving your mouse and now if you don't like the sensitivity you can change the sensitivity settings so go back to your user window and now press ctrl and f9 again to unbind the mouse from the beginning so you can move it again and now go back to the control settings and head to the advanced tab and there just change the percentage number right at the bottom to the value you want it to be so this is your mouse sensitivity and once you're done head back to the game and enjoy goodbye